While COVID-19 cases remain much too high for public health officials liking, we're now learning flu cases are dramatically down in El Paso County, approaching an all-time low. KRDO News Channel 13's Jasmine Arenas joins us live from El Paso County Health Department with that story. Jasmine. Here at the El Paso County Public Health Department, they say those numbers are low, partly due to many following COVID-19 suggested guidelines, such as washing hands, wearing masks, sanitizing, and social distancing. These really stringent precautions we're taking for, for COVID are are having you know a really positive impact in other respiratory diseases. Last flu season, there were more than 3,000 hospitalizations across the state. But this year, according to the CDC, that number is 18, but none of those in El Paso County. I always get a cold every single year, and I haven't had one you know, since 2019, which is so bizarre, but because you know I'm not going into the office, and when I do, I'm wearing a mask and I'm staying away from people. The CDC reporting more than 2 million Coloradans have gotten their flu vaccine. That's a 16.3% increase from around the same time last year. El Paso County Public Health Department believes this is why their numbers are low. A higher level of vaccination occurring within the community and the state. And then in addition to that, we've also got a lot of these really strong mitigation factors or, you know, things that are going into the prevention of respiratory diseases like COVID, but also influenza. And testing for the flu has also increased this season, but this is also impacting children. Last season, the Colorado Department of Public Health and Environment saw more than 650 kids hospitalized with the flu. I don't believe we've had uh, any positive tests here uh, at Children's Colorado, Colorado Springs for the flu. Now, more cases of MISC, the COVID-19 linked condition in children, have been seen across the state than the flu. Yeah, so the public and county health department here in El Paso really recommends that you still get a flu vaccine vaccine. They say that it is still recommended since cases last year spiked in February. They said it's better to play it safe this year. Reporting live in Colorado Springs, Jasmine Arenas, KRDO News Channel 13.